What's happening troops? Welcome back to the channel where today we're going to be playing a brand new game. I actually don't know how long this is but this one is called The Alien Cube. I've heard so much about this game and I saw the Fister played it as well and I was like you know what if uh, Fister played it that means it must be must be good. So why don't we jump into this game called The Alien Cube made by I can't remember his name Guzzle Productions but it was Alessandro or something but let's jump in and see what this spooky game's about. Is it going to be something alien cosmic like what's gonna happen we don't know let's jump in the most merciful thing in the world i think is the inability of, of the human mind to recorrelate its contents they live in a placid island of ignorance in the midst of a black seas of infinity and it was not meant that we should voyage far hp lovecraft oh is this a lovecrafting game if so i was not aware of that or are you just quoting the lads i don't know Oh, I see a dead body. Why are you in a cave? Is this the beginning of Iron Man? Where am oh. I? What am I doing here? I could ask the same question, my guy. Press left mouse button to interact with object space to jump and see to crit. Why can I jump? Can I run? Oh, no. Oh, what the fuck is that? Well, I don't know, but there's a body there. Seems like we saw sort of fell down here. That is moving a lot for a dead body. Hmm. What's this? Examine. The man in the picture is me. How is that possible? What is this place? I could honestly ask the same thing, mate. I could honestly ask the same thing. Is that a head? It's a skull. Why? Got a flashlight or anything? No. Okay, examine. How did I get here? What is this place? I don't know, mate. That's why I'm trying to figure out. I guess we just follow the light. Wait, there's multiple ways to go. We can go that way and we can go this way. Is it raining? Oh, it's outside. Oh. From here, I can see outside, but the crack is too small to get through. I must find another way out. Yeah, I kind of thought that. I was wondering why there was two ways to go. Well, I guess we're going this way then. Hello? Okay, nothing. It's a bit spooky. I'm not going to lie. Very spooky. Ugh. What is this mechanical shit? Okay. Why? What are these gears for? It seems there is some huge machinery behind the wall. Yes. Yes, indeedy. There must be some huge machinery behind the wall. Okay. Oh. It doesn't work. It seems that the gear is missing. Oh, whoa. I don't want to go that way. Uh, no. Nah. What was that sound? I don't know, mate. I really don't want to go check, but I have to. Something escaped. So it's like, that sounded like a big creature. What was that? Sounds like a big creature. Oh my god. What is this alien? Saw the eggs. Okay. Can I take the gear? Ah, ha <laughs> I can take the gear. Good. Well, whoever that was, thank you, because you made me escape a little faster. There we go. And boom. Oh my... Oh my days. It's bright. And it's gorgeous. Wow. See, I don't know if this is like a solo developer or if it's a somewhat team of developers, I'm not sure. Oh, that's quite nice. Have they got water ripples? Oh, they have water ripples. Hmm. That's why you know the game's good. Space to jump. Oh, well, I guess the jump's only for vaulting, I guess. What is that? It keeps telling me to press something. Or is it like saving? Oh! Oh, well, this is very nice. Nice little waterfall going. This is beautiful. Call this a horror game? Ha! Ah, ha! Yeah. Ah! Ah! No, I call this beautiful. I call this cam. This is not a horror game. There's nothing to worry about apart from whatever the hell this is. What is that? A statuette. Oh, you found a secret. Oh, oh, wonderful. I don't know what that was for, but I found a secret. I don't know what the secret's for, or what it does, for that matter of fact. But this is quite nice. What was that? Oh, it's just a tree. Oh, well, this is quite nice. Jump down. That heart. How did that heart? 
Was it like another way to go? Oh! Whoa! Where the fuck are we? Jurassic Park? What the fuck is this place? What's going on? Oh, I don't know. What? 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 What are we looking at? Oh, oh it's a no, meteor! No, no. Oh, right in front of me as well. Damn. You would be dead. You would be dead. Well, that's just left the area smoky. Oh, damn. What was that? It was just a meteor. I kind of get that. But, like, why? Oh, I've got a body. Never noticed. Alright, so what's, what, what's over here? Hello? Okay, Where, what am I looking at? Oh! Hello? Oh! Shit! Is that a cube? Oh! That was a dream! Oh, that's good. Was I dreaming? Yes. What time is it? Eight in the morning, lad. Better get up, get yourself some breakfast, and start your day. Your day starts at 11 a.m. That's what I always say. Your day starts at 11, you've got two hours, roughly, to get up, get dressed, showered, ward, and fed. Milk, eggs, juice, dish soap, rat, po rat poison? Call Pete back. Who's Pete? I don't know who Pete is. Do I live alone? If so, it's a pretty big house for just living alone. A switch. Oh, it's a light. Hey, oh, well, guess I'll have a nice wee shower. Why is there water in the bath already? Hmm. Did I have a one night stand? If so, she better fucked off already. Or he. Tell phone. I should call Jennifer, but not now. I want to have a chill day. Wait, oh, you, can't, you can't win with you, can I? My cassette player. I'm not going anywhere without that. Oh! Oh, I've got little slippers on! <laughs> awesome! Alright. So, telephone, there's a computer! The land of pain. That's me on a computer. It cost me a small fortune, but it allowed me to work for more uh, work more often from home, though. Oh, looks like, oh, this is a really old computer. Oh, Jesus. The land of pain. What is that? Looks like a nice wee game, like a fireworks thing? I don't know. Car keys, oh, we need those. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ah, uh, shallops. Shallops. But it's just a Philips TV, but oh my God. Oh, remember when TVs used to look like that? You know, big boxy things with a big ass, like, kind of outer rim. Jesus. Horrible. Horrible. What's in here? Oh, this is where we go. I guess this is where we need to leave. I better freshen up in the bathroom before I go. I tried that and you didn't let me. Right, freshen up. There we go. Can't stop thinking about that dream. It was as if this strange object was calling me. I was feeling a deep primordial instinct that disturbed me. Who knocks on the door? Hello? I'm not in. Who's at the door? Oh, it's probably the postman. Yeah, by the sounds of things. Yeah, it's the postman. Postman, post- Oh, letter. Oh my fucking god. Edgar's letter. Arthur, my dear nephew. If you're reading this letter, it means that I am gone. I gave instructions to a close friend to deliver this message to you in the event of that something bad would happen to me. In the last few years, we lost contact with one another. I know, and I am sorry for that. My life changed a lot, and I am only a shadow of the man you knew when you were a child. I know that it was hard for you not knowing who your mother was, especially after your father's death. I haven't always been there for you, but I was going through a rough patch. I hope you can forgive me for that. As you know, I have never been married or had children, so I decided to leave you all my possessions even though I don't own a lot. Your inheritance consists of my apartment and the old cabin in the mountains which used to belong to your grandparents. This is all I have left. The apartment is situated in the building at number 13 Old Wood Street in the Winter Falls. It's quite old and is in bad condition, but I could not afford anything better. Amongst my belongings, you will probably find some things that you won't be able to make sense of. I ask you to discard everything without question. I'm referring to, in particular to my manuscripts. They are very personal and as you will perhaps have been told, 
Writing was my only solace in the darkest days. I asked therefore not to read them and not to delve into my research. Get rid of everything so that nothing can be found. You will find the apartment key in this envelope. Do what you want with it. But I beg you to respect my last wish. I have always loved you, your Uncle Edgar. Oh, that's a lot of reading. I don't, I don't, I'm not a reader. It's a letter from Uncle Edgar. It seems that he's left his old flat in town to me. I didn't expect that, but I better go there immediately. All right, well, here we go. I can't go with, it with my pajamas on. I must wear something appropriate. Well, why don't you stop complaining? Go shove on stupid clothes. Here we go. Change clothes. Go wear your big loafers or your big smart shoes. Is it smart shoes? Smart shoes. That's, that's all I've got all I need. Now I can go. Thank you. I would love to go. I would love to leave. I don't want to read that again. Right. Here we go. It'll be a long trip. Edgar's flat is, is many hours away. Oh, the loading screen. Chapter 2! Jesus, that was quick. Chapter 1 was very short. Uncle Edgar disappeared more than a week ago, yet I have received a letter from him only to find out that his sole heir is such a long time since I last saw him. I was only a child at the time, but you must have been fond enough of me to leave his possessions as a legacy. I have never seen where he moved to in the last few years, but after driving for many hours, I have finally reached my destination. Alright, okay. Oh, shit. This is quite nice. Why is it? Why is there an arrow? Oh! Jesus fucking Christ. Right, so... Uh, oh, oh, well, that was a mistake. Alright, what does this one say? What does this say? I don't know what that says. Something... Something odds drowned me. Or... Oh, demons drowned me. I died here. Oh my god, this, part, this apartment is sketchy. I'm going home. There's no reason to go this way. F screw you. Uh, this is the not right apartment. Oh, okay. This looks like uh, Kowloon, man. Oh, this, here it is. This is Edgar's flat. Who is roaming about inside? Hello? I'm not going now. I'm going to have a nice little look at the window. Okay, can't look at the window. I found a statue! Aha, I found another one. I'm good the at this shit. All this time. <gasps> Whoa, shit. What? What the fuck happened there? Hold on a fucking minute. Let me turn the lights on. I can't even see shit. Was it on or off? Whoa, it doesn't work. Okay, that's why. What the fuck happened in here? Jesus! What is breaking? There's so much stuff. Wait, there's no handle. Why is there just a door without a handle? What the fuck? Uh, what the fuck happened? What, what was all the noise? It won't open. There's something outside that's blocking the door. Oh, great. I guess I need to go through the bathroom. Okay, I can't go through the bathroom, but it's a shaver. Oh, hey. Enough of your flickering. Stop it. A grate. What? Ugh. There's something metal that's sparking under the grate. With the right tool, I should be, really, should be able to open it. What's sparking under it? I don't know. The right tool? What would it grab? Exa oh, there's mold and dirt everywhere. Did Uncle Edgar ever clean? I don't know, but there's something in here we could use, maybe? A page! A page from Edgar's journal. Finally, after many years, I returned to the old family home. Unfortunately, when I arrived, I saw that nothing of the house was left. Everything had been reduced to a sad pile of rubble. However, it was there, amongst all the debris, that I found this strange chest. Although clearly very ancient, it was exquisitely crafted made from fine wood and decorated with strange geometric symbols that I've never seen before. At first I didn't notice this, as when I was a child I was used to seeing all kinds of bizarre objects around the house, who found who knows where by my father during one of his countless journeys. The chest, however, had something sinister and mysterious about it, so I decided to extract it from the debris and try to open it. I hope the writing this journal will help me overcome my shock at my discovery, because what I found inside that terrible chest is not something that could belong to this world. Oh! What do you mean, piano? Oh, you're fucking shite, mate. Jesus. Oh, examine. What happened to this mirror? I don't know. What? That looks weird. Huh. Alright, where's that chest that you're talking about, though? I would like to know where the chest drawer. The drawer's locked. What happened to this mirror? I don't know, mate. So what am I supposed to find? There's got to be something in here that, I'm, that I can find. A me mechanism. 
Strange mechanism fitted into the wood. Something has been moved. Something has been removed, showing the gears. Hmm. It's all boarded up as well. What the fuck happened in this place? I didn't turn that on. Oh, fuck! What was that? Turn it off. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. What is that? Jesus Christ! What is wrong with this apartment? Why is everything fucking blown up? What in the actual fuck is going on? Oh, the door's open. It's not open. Whoops, my bad. But why? Like, so that started playing. That fucking blew up. Things over here blew up. Oh, the window. Exploded. Oh, what is that? Under the counter. Oh, something's been living here or something, man. Did I just eat that? Why did I eat that? Why did I fucking do that? Why did I do that? Oh, that food was spoiled. Yeah, I know. There's a strange crack beneath the painting. Maybe I can move it. I can't move it. It's from the fix in the wall. Hmm. Wait, so maybe we can move it somehow later? Move. Oh, here we go. There we go. Right. And then the door opens. Nice. Oh, no. Not all the fine china. God damn. What is this? What is that? I don't even want to know, man. Horrible. What, what, what have I examined? Oh. There's a terrible smell here. How can my uncle ever live in these conditions? I don't know, man. I don't know, but I don't know why I ate the fucking pizza either. Well, I guess nowhere to look. Ugh, what is this disturbing substance? It smells terrible. I don't like this. I don't like the idea at all. But I could try and get through the hole. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? What the fuck was that? I saw someone standing there. What was that? Did I die? Oh, I didn't die. I thought I died. I can't hear a single thing uh, where you're saying to me, I've got fucking Vertigo going. Vertigo? No. Yeah. Well, well. I've got. Tinnitus. There you go. God. My head. Where am I? I don't know. Uh, fucking Vertigo. Vertigo's a free the heights in when you lose your balance and stuff. It's, it was tinnitus. That's what I'm thinking about. Oh, I have to find a way out. Damn it. Why is the door locked, man? Why? Can I find something in anywhere? Like, where do I, what do I do if I can't do anything? Oh, move. Oh, oh. Here's a grate. It looks quite weak. Maybe it'll break it with a kick. Aha! Patch is very narrow, but I have to try. On you go, son. On you go, son. That's a toilet. This is nasty. Right, yep, there you go, son. Well done. Alright. Well, I guess we're back here then. That. Yeah. What opened? Did that open? Journal of a Member of the Order. October 30th. The disappearance of old William's son, Edgar Mitchell, caused us quite a few problems. It has been quite hard to keep track of every officer, but fortunately, they did not find out anything at the scene at the fire. The purpose of that building must remain secret at all times. At the moment, the case is in the hands of our men and the police. That detective won't set foot in our territories anymore. However, we must find out what happened to, get to Edgar and, cl and close the case before someone else snoops around. We'll start by checking his apartment. November 5th. We have proof of existence of the God's Eye. The priestess was right. During the inspection of Edgar's apartment, we found some papers belonging to his father. Old William. Everything suggests that he was in possession of the sacred artifact without us knowing it. How it is possible that such a trusty member of the Order betrayed us. We are trying to understand where his hiding place is. All signs point to a location out of town where there used to be an ancient village inhabited by our ancestors. Okay. Oh. Well, yeah, that's the thing in the other apartment. Oh. Oh. Okay. Why are they spying on on Uncle Edgar? 
Who are those people and why are they, what are they looking for? I do not know. Yeah, the, yeah, the guy was standing here. What the fuck? What the hell is that? It looks like some sort of cocoon. Yeah, he was standing here and then I came through and he smacked me. And he'd be sleeping here as well. There's one, two, three, and a rolled up one in the corner of four beds. Screwdriver, got it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Do we need to back through it? Yeah. Right, so we've got a screwdriver. Don't know what for, but if I'm right, yeah, this thing. Should we only be fitting to move something to move? Remove the gears. Yeah, the so. What? Have you wrote, have you got a journal or something I can look at? Oh, you have. Damn, I'm not reading all that. If you guys want to read this, please do pause it here and then read it because if you're interested. But I'll read this in one time. But my God, that's just a lot for me to read. Right, so there's something in here that it didn't let me do. Oh yeah, they're great. Here we go. Hopefully that'll do something. Yeah, look at that small key. What for? I'll never know. So it's small key. Small key for what? Hmm. Maybe this? Happened to the mirror. No, the plug. The plug's what I'm looking at. I've got a small key. Is it for this? Hmm, no handle. Is it for that? Nope. Is it like an attic or something? I'm pretty sure it's on. Ah! But it's stuck. Okay. So what's the small key for? There's something else I'm missing. Oh! What does that do? There's like a plug or something. Where is it? Aha! There we go! A, draw a page from Edgar's journal. After that horrific discovery, finding the answers to my question became a real obsession. Only I started to study my father's old papers in depth, my research uncovered the existence of a mysterious order. Its origins are extremely ancient, but apparently it still exists today. Indeed, I found some clear references to it in my father's notes, and it seems that he was even a member. I also found out that in addition to the old cabin in the mountains, my father owned many other properties scattered around the area. I didn't even know why. Why didn't he tell me about them? There was one place in particular that was very important to him and it seems that he did everything to keep it a secret made a map showing its location i'll go there immediately oh black hill forest okay so my, so the grandfather william secretly owned a plate a piece of land edgar must have found out on the map okay better go right away i'll come back here later okay that's where the stupid drawings are over the place man all right well guess we're leaving and come back here later Chapter 3, The Secret Location. The road is getting arduous, but I should be almost there. Grandfather's secret place should be in the valley near an ancient castle not far from here. With a bit of luck, I should be able to arrive there before anyone else. Those who captured me are heading right there. Alright, where are we now? Wow. In the middle of buttfuck nowhere. Pretty sure I've already been here though. By the looks of things, I feel like I've already been here. Would I die if I jumped down there? Probably, most likely, yeah. Okay. So, do we go up? Oh, nice car. <laughs> nice car, Ethan. Sorry. I don't even know if that's the guy's name. There's no reason to go this way. All right, right, right. I'm not bad. Jesus. All right, sorry. There we go. Break the law. Going to un whatever territory. Protected territory or whatever the hell it's called. But there's a building. And it's locked. Why is it locked? Can I get in, please? Is it away? Aha! No. Come on, man. You can climb in now. Or boot the door down. Your choice. Okay. I see nothing. Mm-hmm. There's rocks and more rocks. Okay, anything... Any secrets that I should know about? No. What is this? Warning, don't try to trespass. And that's the word I was looking for. My bad. That's the word I was looking for. But what happens if we go up here? Ah, we can't get up there. Alright, go this way then. What is this place? My grandfather's property should be behind that old building over there. What old building? I don't see a building. Oh, wait, that building. Alright. It blends in so well with the rocks, man. What about over here? Any secrets? You can't just keep hiding? Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. 
All right. I see. I'll keep an eye out for some secrets. I'm a secret kind of man. What? Jesus fucking Christ. What the fuck is that? Where am I? Oh, I'm still here. What's going on? I could ask the same question. Whoa! Wait. How? What? And what the fuck has just happened? Why is this here now? I wasn't there before. Huh? I can hear a growling of sorts. I don't like it. What the fuck? Oh, my head. What happened? Did I have a hallucination? I don't know, but push it. That's your way over. Oh, gonna get, suddenly get rid of that tonight. Jesus. Go on, son. That was a push, really. There you, there you go. Good. There we go. We got it. We got it. There you are. Right. Walk over without falling. And there we are. Beautiful. Is this the way we go? I actually don't know what way we're supposed to go. Is there anything over here? Any secrets that much must know about? Any secrets? Come on. No? Wow. So why did you make me walk over here, man? What was the need? Because they're very well hidden, these secrets. In every game, they're very well hidden. And you just stumble upon them by accident. And it's not fun. Right, here we go. Here we go. No, what was that? Ah, bet you a plant. Bet you a plant. It's not what we're wanting. We're wanting secrets. Isn't that right, folks? We're wanting secrets. Da, ah, nothing. Nothing. Wasting my time. Ooh, what's this? A dungeon. With stairs. Hello? I'm gonna fall, I'm not gonna make it. Yeah. Seen that coming. Oh. Fall. I'm not going that way, I hear grilling. Oh. Where am I going? It's an elevator. Okay. It's out. It won't turn on unless there's no power in it. Is that dynamite? Looks like there's no fuel in the generator. Button. Ah, there's nothing I can do to power out, so I do need to go towards the sound. The growling. Fun. That's not always fun, no. Well, you know what? I don't care. I'm a man. I'll go forward. I ain't, I ain't a little bitch. Yeah, I'll go forward into the darkness. Yeah, good choice. Alright. Let's keep running. For some reason. What's this? Another page to read? Let's we'll see if there's anything else I need to pick up. Nope. Explorers' Journal. These places are full of secrets. We're all excited. At night, we observe the sky and those mysterious lights. But like UFOs or something? Well, during the day, we explore these magnificent tunnels. The whole area is full of these underground galleries. It will take days and days to explore them. Inestimable... Estimable... What? What kind of word is that? They're of an estimable... Estimable? Estimable? Esti an estimable? What kind of word? What? But that word, value, who knows what kinds of ancient discoveries we might find deeper inside. It's said that we, that there were ancient underground cities here, connected to each other by a network of tunnels that were populated by obscure cults. In recent history, however, no human being has gone into the depths to confirm that bizarre history. These tunnels are very dangerous indeed, as they could collapse at any moment. Not to mention, the risk of falling into one of those ravines. Rosa scared me when she said that she'd heard a strange voice coming from the depths of the abyss. Who knows what she really heard? It was probably just a poor animal that had fallen down there. Doubt. Doubt. So wait, so why did I come over here? What was the reason? Oh, leave her. Ah, oh, okay. Damn. Why? Why would you do that? You are mean. Why would you do that? That is rude. Am I even going the right way now? Oh, this is the outside. How have I managed to go back? Wait a minute. 
Wait a minute. Huh? That was that a fake death? No. That was not a fake death, was it? No. The game did not just do that to me. It did not just do a fake death on me. That is incredible how they did that. That was smart. I like that. Okay. I see. Oh, yeah. Definitely a fake death. Wow. It's n almost night. It's pretty nice. A fuel. Oh. There we go. Got some fuel. Okay. There's a page there. Telescope. What are we looking through? Oh. Fuck that. I heard. No. What's what's with really the whispers? Is there a statue or something I can pick up? Got to be. There's a page. Explores his journal. We found a wonderful place for camping. Apparently, it's right here, amongst these mountains, that those strange events occur. Last night, we spotted strange lights in the woods. It seems the stories about these old forests are true. We immediately focused the telescope on the point where the light beams appeared, and when we looked through it, none of us could believe our eyes. We were all shocked. How come that planet was so close to Earth? And how does one explain that? It's not there anymore. What we have seen makes no sense. Something is very strange up there. But there was a planet? I don't see a planet, I just hear whispers. Well, listen. There's definitely whispers in that. Don't know why. Ow. Oh, a nice little water. I like it. Oh my god, they're swimming. Holy shit. Oh, there's a body. And another one. Well, that's a shame. Don't want to know how you died, because I don't want to be the same boat. Alright. Weird. I guess we're going back? Fuck knows how the game did that. I'm not going to lie, I don't know how it did that. Because that was very smooth. Hey. What is that? I'm running. I don't care, I'm running. Oh. Oh, I see. This is where I was before. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuel for the generator. There we go. There we are. Are we done? Then turn it on. Ooh, ow! Jesus fuck. Okay, just go. Fucking blown up next to me. Oh, come on, man. Just go, just go. Hurry up. That's gonna. No, that's it. We ain't gonna live. We, we ain't surviving this, man. We ain't surviving this. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> go. <laughs> yep, yeah, look at that. Oh! Right, I did. Fuck, go. Right, go. Cool. I was not expected to actually get blown up there. Right, we're back, we're back, we're back. Run, 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 run. Holy shit! Okay, I don't know what's going on. It's just everything's fucking blown up. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh. Well, apparently we're back out here. Oh, Jesus. Well, that's gone. What about over here? Any secrets? Hiding anything for me? No. Apart from a nice little area. No, you're not hiding anything? Nah, you're not hiding anything. Alright. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck off. I need to do it again. Alright, here we go. Everything's blown up again. Just need to run. I was just about to question that. What the hell happened over there? Who was that guy? I don't know, but I did see somebody run, though. Right, so how are we meant to get over? Oh, we just jump? Whee! Ow, you almost missed that, you absolute twat. Jeez, it wouldn't catch me doing that. Oh, there's a matter I used to get over before. 
All right. Am I good? Am I going to heal? Apparently so. Apparently I'm fine. <laughs> oh, he's actually injured. Oh, wow. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. He's got nothing to worry about. He's a strong man. Come on. Put a bit of ice on it. You'll be fine. Maybe a wee bit of sawdust and all. Well, we'll keep your eyes rain. Give it five minutes with sawdust. <laughs> ah, damn. It's locked. I have to find a way past to get past the vents. I hope that in the building there's something I can use to heal myself. What building? Oh, I guess this would be a way, the way around the fence. On the rocks of danger. Oh, come on, mate. You've got this. There you go. You've got this. I know you're a bit sore, but you've got this. Hey, that's my heart. That's my heart. Uh, yep. Yep. That. Yep. That would hurt. Yep. Of course, hundred percent. Holy shit! Well, well, whatever happened in here it was nice. It's just a bit overgrown by nature, but it's nice. Oh my god! What is in there? I don't know. Are these like body parts and some shit? I don't know. I don't see anything that could... Oh, here we go, medicine cabinet. First aid kit. There you go. Got it. Oh, the first aid kit has everything I needed. My leg is better now. Alright, good. Thank you. Apparently, a wee bit of, a wee bit of bandaging of medicine will help you work. Alright. Uh. Door. It's thought I had to find a way inside the cave. Who knows what my grandfather hid in there. Eh, it could be anything. Aha, I found, this, I found a way. These are some old wooden bowls down here. If I manage to break them, I might be able to open the passages and get through. Break them with what? What are you going to use exactly, big man? Your foot? Your hands? What do you want to do? Choose something. It's got to be something like on the outside. It's like, aha, there's an axe. Give me that. Thank you very much. Thank you. A horror game that actually lets me pick up an axe rather than just being there for decoration. Thank you very much. Now, let's go take down these boards. There we go. That's the way through. Beautiful. Let's get through. Damn. Shot average Dark Souls cave. <laughs> Alright, well, door's here. Uh, we can't open it. It's just still locked, no matter what we do. Alright. Well, what's in here, then? A beautiful cave? Will we find the back cave? Find the back cave, I'm, ra I'm ransacking it. No one's here. Grandfather William's journal. It's all true. I managed to record everything. This is the confirmation I was looking for. I never imagined I would one day be walking right there in the outside. That place is beyond description. There's one thing I shouldn't underestimate though. If I can see, I can be seen. Next time I'll have to tread carefully, but if I want to go deeper, something must have noticed my presence during the exploration. I sense a dreadful malignant presence that I still can't explain that gaze, I still feel it upon me, even now, like I'm writing this journal. I'm not gonna lie, yeah, I feel like I was being watched there. I'm not gonna lie, like, I'll, I'll agree with on that one. Okay. This way, look, look, there's whispering, man, whispering, whispering. Okay, let's keep running. What about we find? Whoa, <gasps> the cube. Ow. Why? <laughs> oh. Oh. God, my head. What happened to me? Did I faint? I have to take this strange object and get out here and study it in the light. Yeah, I don't think you're in the same place. I think you're still holding it? Yeah, it's, it's like it's flashing, yeah. So we're still holding it. Oh, what is that? I don't want to know. Thank you for lighting my way, cube. I'm making it nice and bright in here. There we are. Keep lighting it, thank you. 
I'm still hearing something stare at me and it's not fun. Yeah. What is that? Don't want to know. I just want to get out of here and study it and go home. Oh, fuck. Why is it a door? This is not the same place. It's already night time? How is that possible? I must have been out for many hours. I better go back to my Uncle Edgar's apartment. I'll be able to study the cube there. Alright. I don't think you're anywhere near your car, though. I'm not going to lie to you, big man. I honestly do not think you're anywhere near it. Alright. Well, there's that thingy. Yeah. So there's the old man here. Oh, shit. We had that today as well. That ain't fun. Right. How did they even get back so quickly? I don't get that. How... We, were, we weren't anywhere close to the car. So how are we back so quickly? My car's not here. Where's my car? I don't know. Good question, mate. So at least somebody's nicked it. You absolute buffoon. Why would you leave your car in a random place? Right, I guess I got a radio tower then. Got a radio tower. That's where I'm going. That's my option. Jesus. Alright, so I feel like we can't get over here then, because that's where we need to go, I think. Is it water? I don't know if it has water. I, I can't tell. If I jump down there, I'm probably dead, so... Probably not a good idea. Just stay in the path. Ooh, thunder again. It's probably... Jesus fucking Christ. I've never had that issue before, though. Like getting struck by lightning or someone near me. Never had it. Wouldn't want to. But I thought it'd just be nice to experience once in a while. Ooh! Is it, I cannot open the door. Right, it doesn't matter. Not yet. Oh, I can't do it yet. Right, just go over here. What? What? No! Oh, Jesus Christ! What the fuck was that? Okay. Yep. Yep. Running. 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 Yep. Yep. Yeah, something's chasing me. Yep, something's chasing me. 100%. What is that? It's growling. It's black. I don't know. It could be the Grim Reaper. I don't know. It's not Final Destination, though. So it can't be the Grim Reaper. <laughs> it's just dark. I'm not going the right way, am I? Oh. What in the fuck? Oh, oh, oh no. Oh shit. Oh. What is happening? Oh, my car. Oh, wait, you know what? My car. But how come it wasn't here before? Was everything even real? I don't understand what's happened to me. I must get back to Edgar's apartment and learn more about this strange artifact. Yes, now go home. Even I'm confused. Chapter 4, back at Edgar's. The members of the Order are everywhere, and now they know I'm in possession of the cube. I'm lucky to have found it before they did. From now on, I must be careful. These people are fanatical, and I mustn't allow them to catch me. I'm sure I'll find more information at Edgar's apartment. I hope it's safe there. I just want to go back to the apartment. The, the whole flat building area looks like a piece of shit. Okay. Well... Just run. Just run. Oh. Before I started looking for clothes and power, I have to find a place to hike. Oh, yeah, okay. You do you, big man. Oh, it's still thunder and lightning. Can't hide the Kubernetes part, and I'll find that immediately. Yeah, good point. Oh, look! A gnome! Why? Gotta be somewhere I can hide it. Can I hide it, like, somewhere random and nobody will find it? Oh, I can go upstairs. They'll find in the attic, won't they? They wouldn't find it here. Aha! I have the cube. I'll hide the cube in here until I do my research in Echo's apartment. I might find the answers I've been looking for in there. Yeah, they won't find it. Surely they won't find it. It's just a random box. Jesus fucking Christ. I'm getting sick of this. Oh, what is that? The one I know. 
there's something coming up the stairs. I don't, I don't know. It's dark. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh! Jesus! What was that? I don't know. I'll just try to keep walking down. Like, I, I don't get what, what, where? Who? What member? Why? In what apartment is this? Why am, I, why am I in this apartment? What? Anyway, I just I was staying quiet because I wanted to walk down, but I knew something was going to happen. Oh, it's this apartment. Oh, how nice. Thank you very much. I Stop it. Alright. Okay. Well, let's go to Edgar's apartment. There we are. Hello? Okay. Oh, the lights are on. I can feel something strange when I go near this mirror. Okay. Can I turn these on yet? Hey! Oh, Jesus. Seen that coming. Okay. Hello? Ah, it doesn't work. Of course it doesn't. What am I doing here? I don't know why why I'm here. Why am I why am I in here? Hmm. What's in the attic? It sounds coming from up there, but the trap door is locked. Hmm. Piano? No. Okay. Drawer? Hmm. Nothing. Doesn't work. The painting? I don't know. Someone went through these books they weren't on the floor before. Why? So somebody's been in this apartment while I've not been in it? These drawers weren't like that. Someone's been here while I've been out. Yeah, thought of that. Thought so. Ah, a statuette. There you go. Hello? Hello? I don't like that. It's just under, it's fine. It's just under, it's fine. Let me just shut, I can't shut that. Alright, so we've got the other statuette. There you go. Guess I could just take a guess. Oh! I done it! What did that do? What's in the attic? The sound's coming from up there, but the trap door's locked. What did I do? Oh, does it move the painting? Aha! Oh! The outside, May 14, 1974. What is going on? May I add it's also half three in the morning right now when I'm doing this? So, so far all I'm hearing is like grilling and some static. Are you trying to say this is what the outside sounds like? Okay. That's weird. There's a lever. Lower it. There you go. Oh, what is that fucking sound? What is that? What was in here? Oh. What was in in the... Oh, it came from the mirror. Disgusting substance seems to have come out of the mirror. Yes, I know. I looked at that. It seems like you tried to play the piano. Oh, that's the clue. Ah, I never noticed that. <laughs> what well, I guess. Ah. So what did I do now? Oh. Didn't even notice this. Okay. Hello? Random ass room? Okay, what the fuck is that? The entrance, yeah, but I think we've been in that one. What the fuck is this room? A page from Edgar's journal. Wow, that place really, really my father's secret hideout? It's difficult to believe, but everything suggests it was. 
I tried to bring as many things as I could with me to examine from to examine them here in my study. Many of his notes are written in a language that I don't know how written in a language that I don't know. However, this is his handwriting, I'm sure. Those bizarre photos did nothing more than lead me to ask more questions. Those landscapes are so surreal. What the hell are those huge structures in the distance? Exactly my question, that's what I was asking. It looks like my father was doing research into the ancient artifact and its connection to some mysterious place populated by some sort of horrible beings. But what does this mean? What was he really working on? In the shed there were some strange statuettes and old cassettes too. I brought them here to study them. <gasps> Jesus fucking Christ. There's someone in the park. In the closet I can hide. Yep, fucking hide. Oh no. Oh, they're outside. What? That doesn't sound normal. I'm guessing if I left here, I'll probably die. So I'm not gonna leave. Wow. Is it safe to come out? I don't know. Probably? Okay. Well, um, did they not find what they were looking for? What the fuck came in? Oh. Oh. Oh, do I actually need to climb? Oh shit, I do. Oh look, a painting. Oh, something. Oh, it's fucking. Oh no. I hate this. That is dark as fuck up here, my guy. Oh fuck! I don't like it. I don't know. I don't like what I'm hearing, man. I'm hearing shit. Okay, anything here that's worth taking? What the fuck's this? What strange machinery? What if I place the cube here? <gasps> oh, good question. Good question. Good theory. A page from Edgar's journal again. The strange contraption is the most mysterious object that I took from my father's secret hideout. What's its function? It seems that it allows the creation of a small magnetic field, but something's missing for sure. There was an ancient metal door near the hideout, but I wasn't able to open it. It may lead deep into the mountains, and what I need is probably right there. The whole area is full, full of tunnels and old galleries. People say that in those mountains there's a huge web of underground passages that stretch for miles. Yeah, yeah, they, they did say that. But now that I think of it, the family cabin is not very far from that place. It's, that, it's right at the top of the mountain. What if, somehow, everything's connected by the tunnels? Are there more than them around there? First of all, I should go to the cabin and check it out. I'll leave early in the morning. An old picture of my family's cabin. Alright. Do you want me to get the... The thing? I, I just know it. I'm not stupid. I know how stuff works. I know how games work. It's not going to be there. Sunday found it and took it. Oh, surprisingly not. Hi. Alright, oh well, here we go. The cube is whispering to me. Alright, here we go. Just keep going, just keep going. Don't be a bitch, you absolute. Alright, I'll go through the other way. I'll go through here. This is the way I'll go. We'll go through here. Yep, and we go through this way. There we are. So who stopped? Who stopped me from getting in? It doesn't matter. Squat. Way. No, I can fucking see. Right, place the cube. Beautiful. Turn it on. Oh shit. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. You alright though? You good? Are we all fine? <laughs> we fine and dandy? We're fine and dandy, but there's a hole! What? You? Are you making a hole? Huh. Something in here, man. I'm leaving. Oh, oh, uh, oh my fucking god. Oh god. Okay.
I am so confused. How did we just fall down there? But all, all the cubes gone. Uh, uh, my head. Am I still alive? How is that possible? It's gone. Yeah, no. What's happening to me? Yo, you're getting involved. This is your own fault, mate. The cube has disappeared. Where did it go? See, that's what I just asked. Hey, right, down we go. Down we go. Down we go. Where the fuck's my cube? What the fuck? Uh, hello? Whoa. Oh. What does this mean? What? Hello? It's a lot luckily for me, I don't like the sound that's coming from there at all. What the fuck? What? And what the fuck is going on? It's locked. Okay, there's a cage with some sort of bodies in it, or skeletons, shall I say. Another cage. Guess I'll go this way. Okay. Hello? Oh, there's a body. What happened here? What is this place? I don't know, mate. I could honestly ask the exact same thing. Whoa! I hear a phone! Oh. Oh look, blades, of course, why? Okay, more torture devices. What is that sound? Something in there. Whoa, what is this? That's weird, the fire doesn't emit any heat. Huh. Okay, they need some kind of mechanism to open it. Really? All right, okay. So I'm guessing you want me to go down? Oh, probably not, actually. That's probably the worst idea I've ever had. So you want me to go down? All right, go down. We will go down. I don't hear weird things. Oh, what was that? I feel like I'm getting some sort of like agony vibes. Oh, what is happening now? Oh, strange substance, substance is entering his body. Yeah, that's what I was questioning. What the fuck was that? I kind of don't want to know. I don't know, mate. I could ask the same question. Ah, oh. it's locked. It's also entering his body again. I'm guessing this is where I need to go anyway. Okay, why though? Is there any reason to? Alright. Oh my god, it's loud. Those machines are huge. What could I build on them? I don't know. What's all this for? What if I tried to stop, to stop the gears? Yeah, good question actually. Hmm. Stop them with what? What was that? I mate, mean, I'm hearing sounds and I don't like it. There's a door locked. Am I supposed to be able to figure out but these are just a bit there's just a bunch of big boxes. So there's nothing to really grab. Hmm. Oh there's a body. Hi. An iron bar. Oh we can use that to stop the the machine. Maybe? I don't know. Possibly? Boom. There we are. Jesus fuck. Oh, getting out. It's gonna blow. It's gonna fucking blow. It's gonna fucking blow. Is it gonna blow? Hello? Is it gonna blow? Okay, maybe not. Seems a huge. No, okay, we've seen that. Okay. I don't know what that does though. I don't know where I stopped. Could be anything. Oh, okay. You know what? Fine. I'll take your game. I'll take I'll take your game. Run. Just fucking run. Don't want it always following me. What is chasing me? Is it still chasing me? I can't tell if it's chasing me or not, but I don't know why I'm even going bother. Oh, it's gone. Okay. I don't even know if there's an actual mo- Oh, there is there's something that was chasing me earlier. Alright. I was about to say, I don't even know if there's like an actual monster or not, but... 
Apparently there is. Alright. So does that mean I can open the gate now? Oh, there's something missing here. Since the gate is some kind of mechanism to open it. Ha! Ah, okay. Alright, so do you want me to go back for here? Oh, this is stopped now. Oh, here we go. Give me the... Oh, shit. Sorry, I didn't know this was a person. What sort of creature is this? I have to take that lever. Yeah, take it. Go on. Go on, son. There we are. We got the lever. Is that for the upstairs? For the... the gate? Could be. Yep. What, is something in there? I don't know, but the door's locked anyway. Someone's crying. Whoa. Whoa. What the fuck? Oh, that's how we get back. Oh. Okay, door's locked. What is this place? I don't understand what's going on, but I'm guessing I need to go through this way. Okay, slowly does it. Don't want to hurt yourself. There's a body here. Can okay, we kick it down? Because it's clearly it's in the wrong place. There's another one here. That water. I'm guessing. Oh shit! Okay, it's locked. What do you want me to do? Can I not get through here? Yep. Now uh, what about crouch? Okay. Can I run in? Aha! Oh! Whoa! What the? How is this possible? Where am I? I don't know, mate. I honestly don't know. So ask stupid questions because I don't even know. Ah! Okay, there we go. What we see is this for this. Aha! So where did that? Oh wait, this is for the phone. Oh yay! Maybe we can answer the phone now. Go we'll answer the stupid phone in a minute. I see a door. I'm intrigued. Okay, nothing. Right, right, right. I'm coming to pack you up. Right, Jesus. Oh. What the? Oh, the phone in the apartment. Oh. What the? Is that Cthulhu? Or something? Oh, jeez! Fuck me! Was that supposed to happen? I don't know if I was supposed to- What? Huh? What? 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 That's unfair! Okay, okay, we get it, we get it, get it. Move on, move on, move on. Please. For the love of fuck. So can I hide? And they won't find me? That's what this room is for. Are we ready? Are we, are we okay? Is it gone? Whatever it was, I don't know what it was. It looked like a big demon or something. I don't know what that was that attacked me, but it scared the absolute shit out of me. That's twice I've turned around and it's just been right in my face. I don't know what that was. Okay. Oh no, I need to go here as well, man. Okay. Oh! Oh, that's cool. Right. Oh, we're back. Yeah, and the, 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 the phone, 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 phone. Where's the phone? No, I don't think it is. Right, there's telephone. There's no phone line. Huh? What? What? What do you mean? What do you mean there's no phone line? Okay. Um. I don't understand what I might do now. Check, see if the cube's there or something. The cube is gone, I have to find it all costs, but how? 
I just have to go to the old cabin and where Edgar disappeared, I might find some answers there. Ah, right, okay, good. Right, here we go. There we go. So we need to leave. Right. Oh, I'll happily do that. One out of here. ASAP. Happily do that. Thank you very much. I am out. The gas station. I can't get that place out of my head. What I saw has been in my head the whole way. Edgar's cabin must be somewhere amongst these mountains. Didn't imagine it was a high up though. There's a lot of snow here and it's freezing outside. There should be a gas station just ahead, but a fallen tree is blocking the road. I'll have to leave the car here and continue on foot. 